Hey you guys, so today, um, I just finished watching a video, it's, um, by Air Funnies, it's a guy that is friends with FouseyTube, I believe, or, I'm not sure, don't take my word for it, but he made a video on how to treat a woman, and he had stated the right ways to approach a female in, in the wrong ways, and all that different stuff, and the major point that he had stated was the double standard double standard and that's what I'm going to be talking about one of my biggest pet peeve is double standards why it's okay for men to do certain things but it's not okay for women it's completely and utterly wrong by all means um, first things is it's okay for a guy to have a girlfriend but it's not okay for a girl to have a boyfriend. And mind you, I'm relating a lot of it back to the Middle Eastern culture because that's where I'm from and I really truly want to stick to most of my videos to it. But I will be elaborating a lot more throughout my other videos. But the first thing in our culture, the whole double standard thing. Like, it's okay for guys to have girlfriends, to go out on dates and all that stuff. But it's not okay for girls. Like, why? What makes it any different? Like, I don't understand. And then another thing, why, what's, I don't understand the concept of having opposite sex friends, like, what's so wrong about it, like, I, I don't, I don't, really don't get it, but the thing that he had mentioned in the video is how girls or guys could go out, like, smoke cigarettes, drink, go clubbing, partying, all that stuff, but it's not wrong for a girl and how they get called names. Come on. There's nothing wrong with that. You know what I mean? Mind you, I don't like smoking. It's I just don't like the smell of it. But if a girl wants to smoke a cigarette, then let her do her thing. Like, why do you have to be so judgmental about it? Like, it's just stupid. And there's nothing wrong with a girl that goes out to the club. There's nothing wrong with a girl that goes out with friends and have fun. And it's, you know, and girls that want to drink, go ahead, by all means, drink. As long as you can hold your liquor right, you know, don't get all belligerently drunk and be all over the place sloppy because guys definitely don't like that. But does not lower any girl's standard by all means as long as she carries herself respectfully towards her own self and towards other, as, especially those that respect her as well. There's nothing wrong with that. So for you guys seriously out there, especially Arab guys, stop with your Arab double standard crap. It's annoying and that's why most of you are single. That's why most of you don't last long in a relationship and you're the ones to talk smack. You put yourself in that position. Why? Just someone tell me why. Like it's really, like it doesn't make sense. Um, but it's just another thing. It's what I don't like is double standard thing is how guys can wear whatever it may be and they'll be considered all right or whatever but as soon as a girl wears something it's it's oh she's this she's that and then makes her a lower person we are all human beings sorry this this topic kind of just frustrates me because i deal with it a lot like like, I, I've had a conversation about, I believe, if I wasn't mistaken, this was last Christmas, you guys. This was last Christmas. It was exactly a year ago. I'm talking to someone that had moved out here to the States to, to, for, to go to school for to get his education done. And he said he will not, if he's married and he has a girl, he will not let his girl out of the house he will not let her do anything. She will be strictly going from home to school and school back to home. But his son could do whatever it may be. Like, do you not think that's a wrong way to think? Do you not think? He was like, well, oh, I don't know what would happen. I don't know what she'll be doing. She's going to be whoring around. Not necessarily. I straight up told him, I'm like, do you not think my parents know I'm standing right here in a public spot and that, like, you know, wherever the place I was at. And do they not know I'm talking to you as a guy? I'm like, my parents already know. If you give that trust to your girl, then she won't, you know, betray you. But you'd rather have your boy go around, have sex with every girl, impregnate a girl, and then come about, lie about it, and then blame the girl. I hate that. It's just... Sorry, my new word is redonkulous, by the way. So it's redonkulous 
to even think that. Double stance gets you nowhere, but back in circle and just makes you one of the biggest hypocrites there is out there. So for you men that keep saying it's okay for you to do it and it's not okay for a girl, that's wrong. And mind you, yes, there is limits and exceptions to everything. I'm not talking about a girl going around sleeping with every guy. Because honestly, if you're a dude that sleeps with 6 million girls or a girl that sleeps with 6 million girls, you're both whores regardless. Point blank. Does not make it any difference. You're both putting yourselves out there. You're both doing harm to whatever it means by catching anything. And no, a guy that sleeps around with many girls is not a is not a good thing or not a cool thing because if i'm dating a man that's been around the world mm -mm, deuces on to the next basically it's just it's just completely you know wrong and all that stuff so men with all respect with all due respect to you guys and as a female and as an arab quit your double standard stuff and be realistic it's just it's just natural, you know what I mean? Um, I will post the video of Air Funnies on um below whatever so you guys could check it out. But yeah, so this is a quick brief video, it's nothing major, but it just the whole topic of double standards kinda get on my nerves. I don't know about other females, but I really truly 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 hate it. And I thought it, he brought up a point, so you guys should check it out. Alright, bye.